Hello there, I'm Andrew Hill, and welcome back to some Hearts of Iron 4, Death or Dishonor, playing the Austro-Hungarian Empire. I keep saying Austro-Habsburg, it's actually Austro-Hungarian Empire, though of course Habsburg is all that really matters. We have reclaimed, we've just taken a lot of territory in these, these last few months. What the fuck are you guys doing? Everybody go there! What are you doing? Let's go! Take that shit! And, yeah, we're doing really, really well. We're taking a lot of territory. We're expanding like crazy. I don't know why I lost like a third of my army to go over to Italy for some stupid fucking reason. Alright, what are we running- OH MY GOD! We've already lost all of our infantry equipment! What?! How have we lost all of our infantry equipment already? That is bullshit! You guys broke 30,000 guns already? You fucking madmen. What's wrong with you? Jesus Christ. Come on. What are you doing? You stupid son of a bitch. Ah! Alright, we clearly do not need this many fighters in anti-tank though, do we? Because we have a lot of fighters that are doing fine. Yeah, we have we have a shit ton of fighters. I thought fighters would be the thing that I'd be short on, but nope. Turns out it's goddamn infantry equipment again. Son of a bitch. Infantry equipment and artillery. Ugh. And we're short like a billion steel. What is that? Jesus Christ! Just take that Moscow, let's go! That's it. Yeah, we are a little bit short of equipment right now. But we are pushing them in deep. We've lost- okay, we lost 700,000 men. USSR has lost a few million. Oh, look at that. They're massively conscripting. Oh, shit. They are massively conscripting units. That's not good. We're just desperately trying to take as much as possible here. Guys, take small lens, please. What are you doing? Let's go. Here we go, pushing straight towards Moscow. But man, the population and the infantry equipment is problematic. Holy fuck. 20,000 in the hole, what is that? So many dead. Let's go over there and let's try and cut them off a little bit. Hey, look at that, we took a city! We're taking the cities! Nice. Alright, let's not build too much infrastructure, for God's sakes. Oh man, we are doing this. We are totally fucking doing this. Alright, let's just go right- they're just gonna go right there in that border area. Alright. Here's what's gonna happen. We're not gonna make that front line. Here's what's gonna happen instead. We're gonna surround Moscow entirely and allow their supply to die. Exactly as we did with Berlin in my other series. Literally exactly what we're gonna do. We're just gonna surround Moscow. No 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 You guys are just gonna stand the fuck still. Alright. You will stand the fuck still. 
and calm down. No, 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 no. Okay, we need to maybe cut this front line down a little bit. Because I actually don't want this to this entire bit to fall. I actually don't want anyone to take Moscow. Because I want to wait for that supply to run out. That's the thing. Ooh, I'm going to make a little line here. Boop, boop, whoopsie, whoopsie. There we are. There we are. Perfect. Stop just shy of Moscow. Perfect. I'm just going to completely surround it and everything will be okay. Ain't going to be nothing wrong. Good shit. Alright, okay, so. Here's what's gonna happen. As soon as we're taking this, we're gonna have surrounded Moscow completely. Man, we've, I think we've, we're gonna touch a million dead this, this, uh, this episode. It's pretty crazy. Alright, you stop that. Thank you. Awesome. Okay. Good shit. So. Matt, stop that. We don't want to fight Moscow. No, 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 no. Stop it. Stop it. You guys can just join the main defense. There you go. Stop it. Right, there we go. So, here's what's going to happen. <laughs> I'm going to send... I'm going to take every single infantry division this here. In this little army we have. Assuming this has never been patched out. But I, stu I do believe it still works. Because all supply flows directly through the capital. So that's 21 infantry divisions right there. I swear I have more tanks than that, but alright. 21 infantry divisions, okay? And they're just going to... Stand literally there. That is all they're going to do. You tanks will go over here. Right? Perfect. You're all just going to stand there and do nothing else and surround Moscow while the rest of the army does some shit. And that will slowly cause Moscow to be strangled to death out of due to lack of supply. Which is just awesome. Just it's just awesome. And of course we need more steel. That's okay. We have factories galore. Ah oh, man, the line's been divided. Fuck. There you go. Perfect. I will just turn you off. And then on again. Woo! Alright, the fight begins. So Moscow is completely surrounded with our armed forces. It's alright. Oh no! Shit! Shit, 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 shit. Did not mean to do that. There you go. Sorry, sorry. I accidentally dragged the majority of them over there. No, but that's a different army. What are you doing? I hate that. Why do they keep trying to take Moscow? Stop it. We just gotta wait for the supply to not be able to flow from Moscow. And then they'll be annihilated and there's nothing they can do. And as we gradually move in, north and south... While Moscow remains completely encircled, there's nothing they're going to be able to do. They're still fighting off Finland and all that shit. 
How's the Russian war going? Oh, they've actually had a raid. They've actually had an invasion. Very cool for, for me. Uh, how's the air battle going here? Pretty good. Pretty good. Now we'll just keep letting them do their thing. Taking quite a lot of territory here and there. Nice. Oh, hello, Rostov. Oh man, this is insane. Yeah, we'll hold we'll hold them there because we don't really want that. The main thing is we want Moscow, Stalingrad, all the good shit, really. Need an endless amount of factories. Oh, actually, we need less oil than that. Yay, we don't need that much oil. Or that much tungsten. Because we got some. Or rubber, surprisingly. Weirdly enough. Is there rubber here? Is there rubber? Where'd we get rubber from? Who cares? God, who even knows? Well, this is insane. As long as Moscow is surrounded, after a few days now, they should all start to very gradually lose strength. If I'm right. Let's just take a look. Their average strength is 79%. Then, so now what's going to happen is anytime they lose equipment, they're going to constantly lose that equipment. And there's not going to be any way for them to replenish. Essentially. Yes, 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 we're out of supply, I know. But look at this, though. Some nice growth. Some nice growth. Some sexy expansion here and there. The thing is, is the number of rivers are really fucking me. But every single time we breach a river, we make some gains. Oh, baby. It is good to allow them some time to kind of recover their morale, though, so that's good. That's, it's a good idea. Nice. We are throwing some lives away, but that's okay. So they should now start to really badly lose strength. Like, super badly. We've actually almost taken the entirety of the Ukraine, so let's, uh... Can I, can I please see how many slots are available? Why can't I see how many slots are available? That's very frustrating. There you go. You guys, go over there! Hooray, we don't need any of this. Woo! I get 700 there and 1,000 there. Nice. Everyone go there. You guys can all go into Belarus. Perfect. And this near 1,000 can go there. Come on, guys. Keep taking territory. You gotta get those points down, guys. Let's go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop. What you doing? All right. It's clear that we need to have some time alone here. You guys are just going to stand the fuck still. That's what you're going to do. You're just going to stand the fuck still. And surround Moscow. And stop being fucking idiots. Yeah? There you go. The Mexican opposition joins the allies. What? Democratic Mexico. Oh shit. It's fine. We're not against them. 
How, how's they, how are they doing? They've lost two million men. So, they should now gradually not be able to gather any more- No! Stop it! We're not taking Moscow. We're just standing still. We have no need to take Moscow until they're at least a third down points. There's a lot of points we still need to grab here. What the fuck is happening? Dominion of Canada is doing some shit. Get out of here. Oh, that's a retreat. All right, this is getting a little bit silly, I think. Let's just all go to Tula. Let's all go to Tula. Oh my god, look at that. Let's all start repositioning. Let's all just make a really concerted effort to move in the direction of victory points. Yeah? That seems like a good plan to me. But my god, the infantry equipment deficit is killing me. I just didn't expect that I'd be met with such resistance in this front. You know, what the fuck? I didn't expect that I would lose all my equipment pretty much instantaneously. It was not really what I had in mind. Goddamn, is all I can really say. Goddamn. Doesn't seem to be working. They're still maintaining a lot of their supply and strength, which is problematic. I was hoping this would work. I mean, the strategy doesn't work anymore. Maybe it was a coincidence it worked in my check series. Coincidences are possible. Oh, I'm not going to sign an aggression pack with you. Fuck off. There you go. Come on, guys. There we go. There we go. Nice. We're just climbing in on them. Beautiful. Uh, I don't, I think Moscow's not really gonna capitulate, it's not really gonna capitulate until I have, like, a lot of the victory points. And, I mean, obviously when I take Moscow, I'll get 50, but I want to wait until I'm, like, at least the last third before I try and take Moscow. Because I'd like to keep trying this and see if it works, you know? You're gonna head all the way up there and see what happens. You know what, guys? Every one of you fucking dudes, you're all gonna rush. You're gonna rush Leningrad, let's go. Your job is now to rush Leningrad. That's what you're going to do. You're going to rush fucking Leningrad. Let's go. Because I want it. Rezev. Hey, Rezev. Victory points galore. Oh, baby. Is there anything else we could actually be getting here? Improved relations, daily support, silent workhorse, democratic performer, fascist. Not really. Not really. You get ship designer. Ah, I haven't got naval warfare focus. Reformer or speed, yeah. Whoa, 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 what are you doing? Stop it. Stop it. Don't want to take Moscow. We just want to surround it, alright? Calm down. There's no need to get so overzealous. Everyone's going to go there now. Holy shit, there's actual mass push towards it. It's actually seriously working. Fuck me. Alright, we're we're starting to catch up on tanks, but we still need to just we need we need basically everything. Okay, we have construction engineering, now let's actually get construction repair. Because we're losing everything as well. Christ. So much senseless violence. What can one man do against such reckless hate? No! Stop trying to take Moscow! Stop it! No! Stop trying to take Moscow! Stop it! No! Stop trying to take Moscow! Stop it! Dick! Oh, look at that pocket! So many troops killed. Oh, we took Veronids. Nice, guys. Nice. I'd like to try and take Stalingrad as well, but we'll see. We're getting close, guys. We're getting really close. Ah, oh, Sweden took Leningrad. Fuck you.
There we are. Take Kaylin. Take Kalenin. Nice. Just wipe them out. Good. I actually think they might capitulate pretty soon. Oh no, they took back. They took back Leningrad. That's cool. Right, you know what? Let's put everyone here on a different front. We're gonna edit this front line. Good shit. Fucking everyone here. You guys are gonna be on the massive, awesome task. Yeah! What? I'm trying to make the front line here and you're not. What are you doing? Oh, because it's a different country. Sorry. Alright, there we go. To Leningrad! Once we take Leningrad, then we're gonna be okay. There's a Tula here, throw three victory points. Stalingrad is where the money's at, though. 30 points right there. Oh, baby. God, we've lost almost 2 million men in this war. That's crazy. We managed to secure Moscow, though, so it's okay. Alright, these guys are getting a little bit of a chance to kind of re gather their planning speed and their, their sexiness. Ha, huh, they actually already have maximum plan preparation bonus. Fuck it. Let's go! Woo! Oh, we took Moscow, damn it! I didn't want to take Moscow. You son of a bitch, you took Moscow. I didn't ask you to do that. Who took Moscow? You assholes. Ah, oh, man. Fuck it, you guys are going to have that sexy general there. You guys are going to go for 5 points, 10 points. You guys are going to go to Gorky. Go to Gorky. Off you fucking go. Let's go. Alright. Well, that's pretty good. Not enough for this episode, guys. Uh, we're basically now just waiting until we completely destroy the Soviet Union. We take Leningrad, we take a few more valuable victory points, and then away we go. And we conquer the world, basically. We'll have the entirety of the Soviet Union destroyed. It's going to be tricky, but we'll do it. So, we'll see you next episode. Make sure to check out the other series. My channel, as always, of course, do subscribe to me on Patreon if you want to support me further. And, of course, subscribe to me on here if you haven't done so already. And, as always, leave a like and a comment. I just really appreciate it. I'd love to hear your feedback. I was Aldrin, I'll continue to be. And this has been some Hearts of Iron 4, Death of Sonder, Austria-Hungarian Empire. Bye-bye.